Hello, so we are back and this time we have a phone to repair. Now this is a Samsung S22 Ultra. Let's check the customer email. The customer sent me two jobs, the laptop proof actually to be good and the second one, Samsung S22 Ultra, fell from my bed. Took it to a repair shop who found the motherboard interconnect connector and the interconnect cable is faulty. The shop said they cannot get the right pin side connector and gave back the phone to me. I have uploaded in the files they have sent me to this message. And the customer attached pictures with the damage from the connector. So that's what we have to do. We have somehow to replace the connector and repair this phone. Now, I order the cable and the screen connector. Actually, it's the connector from the motherboard from eBay. Let's have a look at the phone and let's see how we can fix it quickly. The phone is all cracked, as you can see, and we have everything here. Let's go and check under the microscope. So the damage here, as you can see, is the connector from the board. And I bought a new connector and it looks like it's the right size, yeah? Now, apart from this connector, we have the customer uh, flex cable, which is also damaged. That's the reason why I bought another flex. So the flex is fine. Yeah, we have a brand new replacement, but this one, uh, we have to replace it. Now, let's see how we can replace this connector easily. Just give me a little bit of time. Let me take the board out. Now the board is out. Let me use a little bit of Captain tape. Okay, so we mask, uh, you know, the vulnerable uh, parts from the board. So we have the connector clean there on the edge of the board, which make uh, which is making this easy. Now I will be using 400 degrees to take the connector out. Should happen quickly. Perfect. So the connector it's out. Okay, now the connector it's out. We're gonna use 140 degrees uh, soldering paste. A little bit of soldering paste. Yeah, that should be enough. And this way we are lowering the connector, uh, uh, the solder melting temperature, yeah? And that's important for this kind of job. So it's looking good to you? Hmm? Now we are not cleaning because there is flux and the solder and that's fine. I will take out the brand new connector. 245, 245 degrees. I mean, we could wait, but you know, we are trying to do it uh, quickly as possible. You know what I mean? I mean, even with 300, I should not melt that connector. So the solder is melted. Perfect. We should go close to see if the pins are aligned. And no, the pins are not aligned. Now the pins are aligned, huh? Yeah, now the pins are fine. A little bit of liquid rosin. Yeah, liquid rosin. Just a little bit. Perfect. Now let's reflow one more time.
Perfect, and the connector is moving. So we know it's soldered properly. Good. Now all what is left is cleaning. We can clean it with alcohol. A little bit of alcohol. Good. Now we can take out uh, the um, the captain tape just to have a full picture of the board. We are cleaning any uh, you know marks left by the captain tape or by the by the Russian flux. I think we are ready for testing. What do you think? Huh? Let's see. Let's put the board back. I haven't touched the camera yet, yeah? so the camera, they have no prints, nothing on it. Check that, yeah? Uh, perfectly clean. Mm? Yeah. A clean job. Let me put the board back. And the board is back. Let's plug this connector. This connector, this one, perfect, this one, good. The battery is the last one, so uh, let me replace uh, the flex cable. So the flex cable is here. And we have the, we have the RO main here. Click. Have you heard the clicks? Yeah. And here. Click. Yeah. Now plug in the battery. Battery is plugged in. I think we are ready for testing. Huh? Let me grab a charger. The things can go wrong. Yeah, you can have like one pin is not soldered on the connector. That's fine. We can uh, we can resolder again. To plug in the charger and the meter is coming in charging fine and the screen is green lol okay huh why the screen is green i mean do you think it's an issue with the connector hmm? Or the screen has a problem. I mean, here we have some pins which uh, they didn't get soldered. This, this, this. Yeah. Okay, now it's looking better. Good. Now let's show it one more time. You know what? It is what it is. You haven't got it from the from the first try, then it's fine. Yeah? You try one more time. No big deal. It's not, it's not like I'm dealing with phones and soldering connectors every day. So I'm okay. I'm okay.
Check here. No? We have picture. 95% yeah, the battery is fully charged. That's the reason why it's not charging. I mean, I can't believe actually uh, I spent so much time on this one because it didn't work from the from the first time. Uh, powering up the phone, yeah, we can do it. Okay, all good. The phone is on, has a, has a password and a background. Uh, I think uh, I think that's all. We fixed it. it was a hard job, but yeah, all done. Happy I helped the customer. Uh, I will say, uh, you know, thank you for watching. You know, like, subscribe if you like the video, and see you on the next one. Bye.